Hey there, fellow nerds. This is Jonathan from Nerdy Shogun, here to do our first video of First Impressions, where we talk about certain books, manga, or comics that we have read at least the first two volumes of that we want to give our first and foremost thoughts on and whether or not we would recommend this to you. So, for my first video of First Impressions, I'm here to talk about Game Between the Suits, a brand new manga that just recently hit the shelves. A new adult romance manga, I should say. So, we have our main characters here of Sayo and Ryochi. Our two main characters here are basically workaholics who are looking for a decent relationship. The problem is here with Sayo, her whole issue is that she is practically married to her work. She will even answer work calls during lovemaking with her respective partners. Because of this, there's not a lot of many people who will be interested in her when they realize that she is such a workaholic. And this devastates her, even though she does not show it. But then along comes Ryochi, a man who is a bit of a playboy, the newest guy in the office, and she is tasked with showing him around. And during this time, he shows his interest in her in a little bit of a creepy vibe. But all in all, it's just more or less the fact that she is interested in the fact that he is interested in her but they both agree on an arrangement. They will only sleep together until they find someone else that they want to form a relationship with or unless they fall in love with each other. Interesting premise? Yes. Does it allow for a good bit of spice? Absolutely. For myself, I'm more interested in the romances that have a little bit of spice to them, mostly because I feel like I'm more attached to the adult romances than I am the dramatic sort of I don't know, what's the word I'm looking for? Teen romances, I guess? Probably just because of my adult mind, maybe. Regardless though, would I recommend this manga? If you're interested in a bit of spice, I do recommend this manga. Or, if you want something that seems interesting, check this out. You might be interested in a new romance if you're an adult who wants a bit of spice, or you want a more adult romance. Especially since this manga just appeared on the shelves with the first three volumes, I'm not entirely sure how long this manga series will go for, but I am interested to find out more. Especially because the first volume hits you with the action right from the get-go, and it makes for a very interesting and gripping manga, in my personal opinion. So once again, do I recommend this? Absolutely. First impressions? Well, I would say my overall score for it would be a good... Let's go 8 out of 10 because there is a lot of promise here, and it does have a good amount of spice, but I am more interested in to see how the plot will develop with these two characters, especially with Sayo. I am expecting a mental breakdown at some point or other, because let's face it, you can't just shoulder all of that work, as well as the mental degradation on your mind, and not eventually collapse. So I'm keen to see if she will ever go through that experience or not, and if Ryochi will be there to catch her. We'll just have to wait and see. All in all, you guys, if you have any other manga you want us to do any more first impressions for, let us know here in the comments section down below. Thank you for watching this video. If you liked it, feel free to leave a like, comment your thoughts, or subscribe if you're interested for more future first impressions videos. Thank you all for listening. This is Jonathan from Nerdy Shogun, signing out. Have a great day.